Good morning, day five. Yes, day five. Where is it all going? Just, yeah, always just zaps by at Walt Disney World it's because you're on the go all the time. Uh, last two days have hit me hard in regards to burnout, so I've really tried to watch what I'm doing, not overdo it. So I have been kind of tired the last two days. Uh, reaching about 5 p.m., 6 p.m., it was hitting me hard. So I, f I was kind of New, New Year's Eve and yesterday New Year's Day day. So I had to be careful that I didn't overdo it. Plus with the weather um, and crowds and all that stuff can just really zap me. Um, I don't know about you guys, but it just it was getting there. So I had to make sure that I wasn't overwhelmed in regards to just getting really tired and ruin the rest of basically the, the trip. Because you just want to do everything, and you can't. So, just, just, yeah, bear that in mind that uh, there's a lot to do, and you can't do it all, and don't get caught out. Because um, I could be like that. I just want to go and do everything, and you just can't do everything, like in the one day or as quickly as you maybe think it is on these peak days. I mean, this is this is peak time, peak travel. I get that. I'm here at the kind of peak, um, holiday time, holiday season. So. I understand that. But anyway, this is day five. Today's plan for myself is I'm going to have plenty of coffee just now. <laughs> I'm going to have coffee in my room um, quickly. And then I'm going to head to Disney Springs, see what's new there. And I'm not going to walk around all the shops. I just want to kind of get the vibe. I like the, the vibe of Disney Springs, walk around, see a few things, maybe get a treat or two for breakfast. Um, and then you can't get a bus from... Disney Springs to the theme parks, so um, you can get them to resorts, but back and forth. But there is a little trick that I know that I can get. I'm going to go to Hollywood Studios from Disney Springs. I'm going to head out over to Hollywood Studios because I've got that park reserved for today. And I want to see night time uh, at Hollywood Studios. So I, I was there briefly, but I'm going to try and get to things like... I want see Rise of Resistance. I want to get on that. That's the kind of main attraction that I want to try so but I just check the times there as well and it's 315 minutes already wait time like you stand by queue and there's no uh, they call it individual lightning lane you have to pay an additional uh, fee on top of like sort of for example here's like 25 dollars to get into that queue now I'm willing to pay that if the option's there but the option's not even there for that just now because because the queue is 315 minutes so you need to wait in that queue to get a go or a shot on that ride to go on that ride yeah i'm not staying in that queue for that long um but yeah i'm gonna go to hollywood studios i want to see some new things uh see what's happening see what's what's different um at night time maybe try and go to phantasmic as well I don't know if you know what that is but phantasmic show uh, at night time is two showings i think it's one at 8 p.m and half past nine or half past eight and half past nine uh, tonight, so I'm thinking about doing that, but anyway, I'm going to get some coffee, then I'm going to get on the bus to Disney Springs, and then hopefully get to Hollywood Studios from there, so let's go. It's been really handy having a Keurig machine in my room, <laughs> oh, plus they've been really nice to stock up for me as well, the housekeeping have come in and stocked up. of well, Disney World Champions so I've opened up the curtains to my room and the view this is your first time watching myself on this series I can see Hollywood's Tower of Terror attraction at Hollywood Studios you can also see Epcot looking out to the left such a cool view. It's a great, great hotel. You are close to uh, Disney's Animal Kingdom and Hollywood Studios. You're literally five, ten minutes on the one of the Disney buses. So yeah, I'm going to drink my coffee and then get on a bus. So I'm just about to finish my coffee. This is the current times just now at Disney's Hollywood Studios for attractions and shows. So. 
Just give an idea. 70 minutes for alien swirl, swirling saucers. Phantasmic show, there you go, so 8pm and 9.30pm. Hopefully I get to one of them. Indiana Jones, got to see that the other day, so if you haven't seen that vlog, a few clips from my trip, maybe watch that. Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway, 90 minutes standby. Millennium Falcon, Smuggler's Run, I actually enjoyed that, so again, I was on that the other day. Oops, didn't mean to click that. So, I enjoyed that, I managed to get on that through the single rider skew. So I'll be 10 minutes and get in. There to go on that. Muppets, Rock and Roller Coaster, loved that. 80 minutes standby. Slinky Dog, 170 minutes. No Genie Plus, currently offered. Star Tours, the old school classic Star Tours, Star Wars. Yeah, it's kind of simulation. Right, it's 55 minutes. That's the one that I would love to get on. I have been on yet. Star Wars Rise of the Resistance. 315 minutes, it's still shown. And no individual lighting lane. Again, if that came up for an option for me to purchase, I'm going to do it when I'm in the park. Toy Story Mania. We managed to go on that the other night as well. Well, myself, it was great, good fun. That's currently 120 minute wait. Terra Terra, which we can see from my window in the hotel, 135 minutes. So that's the current times just now. And yeah, that's a long time to be waiting in, in queues. But let's go, it looks like another beautiful day today in Orlando. Let's get on, let's get out of the hotel and go on this bus to Disney Springs. Let's go, Disney Springs and in Hollywood Studios. Lights off. Magic elevator. D. I like the sound this makes. What a beautiful day this is. Wow. And it's warm. I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Hey, what bus did I get? What bus stop did I go to? I know what bus to get. I just love the vibe of Disney Springs. Such a beautiful day as well. Look at the Aeroflot. I think that's what it's called off the top of my head just now. Going up the balloon. I have been up on that before. I haven't done a video of it, but one day I'll go back up. But just look at this, take this in. Great vibe. So I have no plan for Disney Springs. I'm just taking the sights and sounds, the smells, may get some treats, but just, I love this place. But let's go and explore. It's not busy, so I can see so far. It's busy enough, but anyway, let's go see what I can see. Not to. So let's check out the older Disney. All the 50th merch are still going strong. Oh, I was talking to me there. <laughs> still going strong in this section. After that 
access to my mug collection. How cool is that? I like these. These a dish towel, one dish towel. T-shirt's nice. I like the fact that it's plain. It just has that on the sleeve. Oh, I'm tempted. I don't know what's going on behind me. Even the jump, even the jumper's nice. Let's go before I buy at the whole store. Some food. That's my face when I seen a long queue for a Lego store. No joke, it's about half an hour to get in. Well, the first for me, I'm going to try a deluxe burger. I'm going to do the mobile app as well on uh, my Disney experience. So, I don't know what I'm going to get yet. So many choices. So, I have placed my order. If you haven't done mobile uh, ordering before, you get an arrival window, sometimes it's there and then, sometimes it's not, so just now it is just after 1pm I need to arrive at the... Well, arrive at Deluxe, I'm at Deluxe just now, but I need to arrive between this window 120 to 150 and then I select that I am here on the app, so it'll come up saying I'm, I'm here, prepare my meal or order, click on that and then you need to wait again until your uh, order is confirmed and you go and collect it so I'm waiting just now in this tranquil environment. So yeah, I'm gonna have this food and then I think I'm gonna head into Hollywood Studios. Whilst I'm waiting, I'm gonna have a look at the wait times at Hollywood Studios for some of the attractions, so let's have a look. They're all pretty much still the same apart from Rise of the Resistance is now only <laughs> 205 minutes. Still can't purchase individual lightning lane, but I'll be heading over nonetheless. So, this is the Toy Story 95 minutes, Slinky Dog is 160 minutes, Rock and Roller Coaster 110, so pretty busy. Over at Hollywood Studios, even the Smugglers Run 105, Mickey Minnie's 150. So now I have the option, so I've arrived, well I've been here anyway, but I'm at, my, I'm at my window, all you do is I'm here, it sends a request, and then they'll prepare your order, and they'll tell you once it's done. And we are ready, counter two, let's go get my burger! <laughs> So I got a to-go order. There's no room inside to sit, so I'm back outside sitting on a wall. Look at this. It's like a bacon and blue cheese burger. So I'm going to sit here and enjoy this. Take in the sights and sounds. I'll open it. I'll open it up so you can, can you see there? Look at that. Oh, that looks so good. And I've got some water as well. So, I'm going to have this. And sit and chill here. So here we go, my first deluxe ever burger. Look at that. I took the tomato out. Mmm. Very salty. I think that's a cheese though. It's nice. No, oh, I'm dripping everywhere. Right, I'm going to enjoy this. Well, I finished that quite quickly. That was really nice. I'm torn between the price as much as I enjoyed it. I did really, really enjoy it. I'll probably see that as a treat more than anything else. I'm looking at the price just now. So that was thirteen ninety nine just for the burger before tax. I got a water as well, which was three seventy-five. So in total, that was plus tax was eighteen dollars sixty-five. So nineteen dollars for a burger 
and a water. So it is expensive in my opinion, but it was really nice. Anyway, onwards and upwards, let's go to Hollywood Studios. One day I will get one of these aqua cars and get out in that water. Nice day for it. So how am I getting to Hollywood Studios? So I'm at the bus transportation area and I'm walking towards the resort that's next to it to get a bus from there. So Saratoga Springs, right next to Disney Springs. There's the boat transportation. There's a boat coming in. You can see Disney Springs across the way. And I'm going to walk and get a bus from Saratoga Springs. So I'm not sure how long I'm going to wait for a bus, but I've got a bit of time, so we'll get there nonetheless. This is just an amazing day. Just look at Disney Springs now. Look at this. So I'm going to take this path here. It'll take me around to the side, to the side, then to the front. And there should be a bus stop just there. And there is the bus stop. It just says Congress Park on it. Here. Bus stop's right there. Just like that, we are back in the land of Hollywood Studios. <laughs> let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I've got blue milk this time. I'm going to try some green milk. Green milk today. To be fair, the blue milk is nice, it doesn't dry up last time. Trying some different. Mm. That's actually really nice. It's like a pineapple, is it? I like this. Is it better than the blue one? Mm. Oh. That was refreshing. That was actually really nice. I like them both.
Francois? Double the patrols. Interrogate the merchants. Detain travelers. I want information. Do not fail, Lieutenant. Are we clear? We are clear. I want recon units to question anyone you find suspicious. If you find someone working with our enemy, I want you to bring them to me and I will deal with them myself. Do I make myself clear? Dismissed. So I'm leaving Galaxy's Edge just now. Make it back later, you never know. Let's see if we can watch Beauty and the Beast. Life. See if I can get in. In a faraway land, a young prince lived in good beauty. Some living. She had seen that there was no love in his heart, and as punishment, she transformed him into a hideous beast and placed a powerful spell on the castle. Highly recommend, great show, great actors, great singers. Yeah, if you get into watch that, go for it. I'm going to have a look at Fantasmic just now. The queue is, oh, everyone's queuing just now, and it's nearly two hours before the show starts for the 8 o'clock, 8 p.m. showing. So I don't think I'll be going to that one. But I'm going to walk around just now and see what else. I try to find some light here and see what else I can see or get up to. I might actually look at the times of the rides just now and see where we are, where we're sitting with them, just to give you an idea as well and to see what I can do. So apologies if you can't see me, but it is getting dark and I'm in Hollywood. Right, okay, let's have a look. Star Wars Rise of Resistance, what are you doing to me? Still a long wait, 210 minutes. And it's only, I say only, but it's half past six, but it's been like that all day. And I know, I do know, that you have to get in early and up early and say 7am to try and get uh, booked on it, but I would pay if that 
jump just now to say individual light lane to pay for it, I would pay for it. But yeah, all day it's been the same. Very busy, very busy day and time of year. But let's go for a walk around the park and see what else we can get up to. Let's go in and watch Muppet Vision just for something to do. It's just about to start, so let's go. Classic Muppet Show, love it. Am I thinking about food? Yes, I am thinking about food, always. I'm going to get a pretzel out of Baseline. Yeah, they look good. Bigger pretzels, kind of big pretzels rather than the normal pretzels you get in the vans. The snack vans, it's not, I can't call them snack vans, but the snack areas. So I'm going to get one of them. It's 20 past 7 and the night's still young. So get one of them and see what's next. Well, look at the size of this. This looks amazing. And the sauce as well. So you've got like a cheese sauce thing and a spicy mustard sauce. And I got a cider as well, 22 ounce cider. This all came to roughly about $23. Including tax, that was the total price. So I'm going to enjoy this. And then get back to... Oh, this looks like a big smiley face. Anyway, I'm going to do this and then get back to the adventures of Hollywood Studios. Ready for this? Oh, look at this. Okay, it's not focusing, but anyway, looks good. Yeah, that's the cheese. Oh, that's really good. Oh, wow. Mmm. So good. Woo. Right, this must be the spicy mustard. I'm looking forward to this. Because as you all know, if you follow me, watch me, I like my spicy food, so let's go for it. Here we go. <laughs> it's got a kick to it. Mm. That's really good smell. Now I'm fussy with mustard, but I like that. Oh. I prefer this to the cheese. The cheese is nice. But I like this. Oh. So, it's a highly recommend for me. Very filling. I struggle to eat finished it. I finished it, <laughs> of course. We do also have a cheese board, which looks really nice. Seen someone having that. Anyway, oh, the cider is also nice as well. Had that already. Thinking you go for a little sleep after. <laughs> really, really nice. Right, where do we go now? Surprise, surprise! I'm in Galaxy's Edge. <laughs> I just love this place. I fell in love with this place, so I'm gonna have a look at night time. The Millennium Falcon just looks so good. Night time. The whole place looks it's like a different world, a different galaxy, some might say. MD1217. Please report to the armory for helmet resizing. Well, what is that? Did you hear that? Sorry, as I was saying, I nearly get eaten by a monster. Sadly, I am leaving Galaxy's Edge. I don't think I'll ever be back on this trip. Because look at the queue, and I can't go in right the lane. So I have tried the last two occasions, but it gives me an excuse to come back. And I'm not telling you when, because that's some good news coming as well, so make sure you subscribe for that. But I'm going to head out of the Galaxy Edge and head towards the Hollywood area, back there again.
So I am making another controversial decision. I am going to wait for the fireworks for Wonderful World of Animation. That starts at 9 o'clock. So I have never seen them before. And hopefully I make Fantasmic after that. I have seen Fantasmic, but I haven't, but I haven't seen the fireworks. So get the fireworks done and then go and do Fantasmic. Go and see Fantasmic. I don't know. We'll see how that goes. The wonderful world of animation. Tonight's the night, right here at the Chinese Theater for Mickey's premiere. This gala is sure to be the talk of the town as every star in Hollywood has gathered to see Mickey's latest sensational picture. <laughs> Good that actually was. If you haven't seen it, go and see it. If you've seen it, go and see it again. There's a mad dash for the bus. Oh, there's a bus sitting waiting. Let's go, shortcut. Home sweet home. So, day five is over. Feels horrible saying it. But yeah, it's over, done, and another day at Hollywood Studios. I do actually like that park. I, I say that because there's a, a few folk that I've seen that don't enjoy it. Um, maybe it's the first time because I've been, I've been there for a long time. Um, first time I've seen Galaxy's Edge, not tonight, but in general, this, this trip. Um, uh, it's just, you always see different things and different reactions, and this time I've seen the, the resistance part of Star Wars. 
in that park. I never seen it last time, so that was cool. Uh, briefly, I seen it. Don't really know when they're gonna appear, but well, maybe we do. I don't know that yet, but that was cool. I never went on many rides, if any. Did I go on any rides today? I don't think I did. But feeling that I done I done some shows and fireworks. Yeah, I feel like I've done a lot, but I don't. The Muppets. That was that was always always like kind of a bit of nostalgia. It's got to say nostalgia, but yeah, it's like that. Just, it's a classic, it's been there for so long, it's been the same as far as I know since since it started, nothing's really changed in regard to the to what you watch, but yeah, I had a good day, Disney Springs, Hollywood Studios, so I got the bus from Saratoga Springs into the uh, theme park to, to Hollywood Studios, yeah, I had a good day. It was, even though just now it's quarter to eleven at night, I enjoyed it. Uh, the only thing is I never got on, and I'm not going to get on, Rise of the Resistance on this trip. Because tomorrow is my last full day of this trip. So, yep, I'm only here for seven nights on this trip. But who knows, there might be more coming. But anyway, I'm going to go to my bed. So, if you've watched this far, thank you for watching, you know what to do, subscribe, like, comment, all my information in the description box, have a look at that, and until the next vlog, I'll see you all then, bye bye.